di 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 domino Watch me Hold up. In a just no woman at all, can no woman at all. Free man never just want the shawl, and that's why no woman at fall. Can no good man at call, and a fall, the name a call. But me nah mind, wait, wait, I no mind. Next thing me go mind, wait, a man fi mind. Then they say no mind, then me think I mind. Then he then a fool, a man say mind. Then he never know, say say a mind. Me think you no mind, mind where mind. Me nah mind, where you no. Hey, you see that we live here? Me vice. Just a roll and it a bug, you know Me say me drink Hold up! You know just no woman at all Can no woman at all Free man never just want the shawl And that's why no woman at all Can no good man at all And at all, the name a call But me nah mind Wait, wait I no mind Next thing me go mind Wait, a man fi mind Then they say no mind Then me think a mind Then he then a fool A man say mind Then he never know Say, say a mind Me think you know Di 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 What a me Mother's lifestyle. Welcome back to the channel. It's a reaction video. Who made it to this table? Of course, you and I were here. We're back like we never left. Lazy people everywhere. A quick reminder: if you love me, I love you back. I love you with the with. I love you back to back. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Backpackers everywhere, lazy people everywhere. Where's my backpacker? Where are we? Of course, we are still very much around Jamaica, Jamaica baby. We are, in fact, we are everywhere. Only she, she, she. Hope you enjoyed that. You evening. guys are too much. You. Without you guys, like seriously, how can we run this show? Mm? Have you grabbed something? Grab whatever that is grabbable. Me, I got my bottle of water here. Hey, hey. water therapy all the way. Before we bring the backpackers, you understand, there's something we need to look at. <laughs> I saw another video done by Peter C7 when our Jamaica grandma was in Yamahanze. So this Peter C7 interviewed her. We're going to look at that. Who else is here? The Kengas are here. D of Donatus Association of Kenya made it to the temple of course coco mama of the most high you and i hey the blessed ones we are always here anyway thank you thank you for joining coco mama again like you normally do yeah can we start joyce's hmm. joyce's is another mama that was in yabohanze around november just before the party okay we will be looking at what she got for us as well can we get started? Where do we start? In fact, in fact, let's start from Peter C7. In fact, let's start from D of the Natus Association of Kenya. D, of course, went to this slum in Nairobi. A big girl coughed out some money out of her pocket and went and blessed some residents in this slum. She didn't just go there to, you know, move around with her GoPro camera. No she bought something and she gave to them that's a good one there but what i don't understand is they were doing it like you know how you will program your thing oh i'm gonna go and spend 1500 kenyan shillings i will give them families this whatever that comes i don't care because of their dressing they dress like school girls of course they got the attention of the children and the children were like coming back from school so while they were hanging out there and B and her friend, they were packing these plastic bags that they want to hand out to the residents of the slum. I expected D to, you know, you know, include the children, buy some candies. No, baby girl was not even bothered. In her mind, I want to do this. I want to give 10 families this and that's it. Thank goodness that there was another lady that managed to buy some candies and gave to the children. Let's watch them. Yeah, that's going to be easy. And just put a smile on people's faces because today is my last day. I'm soon going to the countryside and I won't have enough time again to come back. So welcome to Madare, one of the most popular ghettos or slums in Kenya. So this life is same everywhere. So Jamaicans, you can relate. Let me know the similarities and the differences, okay? Zach. Hey. Mm. <laughs> Gift for you, right? Oh, you may put your column, keep up in the upper. I am not a Muslim, 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 Musl
This is not Madame's normal regular vlog. Ordinarily, you will never see her go, you know, except if village content, yes, she loves. If she's not doing buji buji buji, I'm known internationally. She's doing village content, of course, for viral videos. Going to the slum, she did this because of the kind of content she did with her man over there in Jamaica. So now she's telling her Jamaica people, mm, here is your empress. Can you compare? Here we are. Can you compare the slum over there to what we have here? That's the main reason why she's doing this. She wants to show her audience, of course, Jamaican audience, what a slum looks like. In Kenya, it's not a bad thing. Yeah, but they must include the children. If you must record them, you must drop something for them. Not bringing a few pieces of candy and then telling them to go home and go remove their uniform, go help their mom. Nah, 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 nah. She's saying that, oh, this is my last day going to countryside. Which countryside? D, Madam D, show us your village. Show us the, you can, charity, you will always say it, charity begins at home. You can show us your own village. Show your people your village. Don't say, oh, I'll be going to countryside. I still believe that D is actually in your hands. Remember that time she brought BMW? There was rumor that D actually was already in the village. <laughs> I thought I have seen it. Yes, she was already by her parents. Even that time. Overthinking will not finish us. She was already there in the village when the BMW came. So probably she went back to Nairobi. She left the village without recording. That's why I believe that Kino can actually be in Nairobi and not show himself. And of course, he will be showing us the content that he has already recorded, like the content that he kept already. Yeah. Peter C1 interviewed our Jamaican grandma. May her soul continue to rest in peace if she's dead. But if she's not dead, Alhamdulillah, we thank God for her life. May God continue to protect her for us. Mm -hmm. Our grandma will always be here. She will forever be in our hearts. There's no point, again, us, you know, thinking that, oh, we are saying too much or talking too much about her. Peter C. One did this interview. Something caught my attention. Mama said it, that the problem she has in Yabahanze is malaria, mosquito bite. <laughs> Was she treated? Was she informed to get treatment? Since she has already confirmed, her confirming that she was beaten by mosquitoes. Did she get the treatment? Was she treated malaria? This is a question that we need answers. For. There's something that she said to Peter C1. She said that when she was in UK, okay, people would always think that she's not Jamaican, she's not black because of her skin color. And she went to this Jamaican shop looking for yam. And the Jamaicans that saw her, they started gossiping and was like, oh, this one, what does she know about yam? She pretended. And she said, it's always good to pretend sometimes. Whatever these vagabonds, whatever these vultures that took advantage of her, right from the borders, okay? When she was still in Tanzania, the border border drivers started overcharging her because they can smell, they can see that she's a foreigner. Border border that she's supposed to pay 1,000. She said that she was asked to pay 5K, but she refused. The Jamaica in her came through and through. She switched her accent and was like, why, why? You told me it's 1,000, why charging me 5K? No, you can tell that she's aware of all these things. So if the Marwas and his crook took advantage of her, wanted her to pay for certain things, you know, giving her all this lip service. Oh, my man, man, don't worry. Hey, you don't have to. No, why are you buying your food? Huh? <laughs> when you, you in, right there in your mind, you want her to buy, but you are just pretending. Why forcing her to buy land? She also told Peter that she's escaping from UK weather. She grew up in the UK. She was there throughout her teenage age, schooled there. And um, she was born in Jamaica, but she left at her early stage to the UK and she has retired. She wants to escape permanently because UK weather really affects her, plus her age. She said all that. Let's listen to them before we move ahead ahead. Hey! Madam Vidi Jonah. Till now, they have not shared their official wedding video. <laughs> hey! Even the one that Vidi Jonah was recording. Black Animal, what is this? 
Madame Vidigiona came for the marrow. Madame Vidigiona was like, do you want me to tell you the, the truth, truth, or the fake truth? Hey! Guess what? Madame Vidigiona found Vidigiona through marrow. But in another interview, she said that they didn't meet online because she's not online person. Say what you mean, I mean what you say, madam. Anyway, let's put her one side. Let's listen to our Jamaican grandma and Peter C7. There's something that Peter C7 did, and I'm gonna commend him. Someone was telling him, hope you can take this mama safely back to her family. He replied this person and he was like, I've already messaged her, but she didn't reply me yet. This was a month ago. Let's read that before we watch them. I haven't seen Grammy for quite some time. Please make sure she safely gets back to her family. Oh yeah, sure. I tested her. She hasn't replied. Peter and this person was having this conversation about one month ago. Peter was not the one that welcomed Mama to his home. Mama did not give Peter money to put perimeter walls for her. Mama did not do any business with Peter. Peter just randomly asked Mama for collaboration. But when Mama left Yabuhanse, when Mama left Kenya, he messaged Mama to follow up. But Mama did not reply. According to Peter, this is message from another YouTuber who Mama did not trust, who Mama did not sing his praises, who mama did not, you know, support wholeheartedly with. She said that she's no longer watching television. She only supports Marwa. She believes so much in Marwa. Mr. Kenge did not message her. Oh, she talks to that guy. There's another guy she talks to. You know one thing with this guy, okay, Mr. Kenge? He would never change because I've never seen someone who... Even when he knows that what he has done is wrong, he is still claiming that he's right. Oh, this is what she said about, it's not about what she said. This mama said it, that sometimes you just pretend. Just people will think that you don't know what is going on. People will think that you don't know that they are trying to take advantage of you. They are trying to milk a hell out of you. You just pretend. She's not a baby. How can you come to your hands and then you start talking trash about Marwa? Joy sees that is now claiming that she's gonna open if somebody else passes away in the emergency, she's gonna open up that she's feeling guilty. When Joy sees came to Yabohansa for the first time, she came for us. She actually claimed that oh I'm running after the Virginia, that I should go look for my age, that my man doesn't satisfy me. Where is your proof, madam? Bipolar to the highest order. Believe Joyce is at your own risk. I said it. She's a confused woman. She already said it that she has mentals. Only a mental person behaves like this. You don't know anything about us. You don't know what we are doing. You came to your hands. Then you realize that, oh, these people are talking about this family. You are jumping, insulting a hell out of us. After you left, what you thought that you would gain, you forgot that this is your hands views. When we were saying it, she thought that we were joking. It's not about going to collaborate with a big fish. You can do it on your own. Because what happens again is, these other guys, what are we saying now? Everybody that came with intention. That's why this mama said, Jamaican mama said that, I'm not a YouTuber. She collaborated with Nasto. She told Nasto the same thing. I'm not a YouTuber, so you guys should not think. She purely came to settle down in Africa. That was her intention. You can tell. She said she has retired. She said she, she wants to escape from the weather, the cold weather of the UK. She said she's happy. She said cost of living is very, very cheap, especially in the village. In Nairobi and Mombasa, it might not be as cheap as the village, but of course, she wanted to settle down in the village. You know? Let's listen to her. It's so sad. Peter C7 reached out to her you know if this guy had dropped this message after her passing we would say that oh he's pretending he actually dropped this message one month ago he messaged her but she hasn't replied but the kangas 
Kenga's, Kenga's mom, Kenga's dad that was even holding her. And you can convince her to buy a land. But when she left, till she passed on, it was someone that broke the news to you. And till now, this guy is still claiming that he is right with his defense force. The crooks are still covering him up. Hmm. Not under our nose. That will not happen. Let's watch Mama. From being here, I feel comfortable. I feel relaxed. I don't feel threatened. Yeah. I'm eating well. I'm getting the sunshine. Look at that. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, yeah the, 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 the tan yeah. that I have, yes, even though mosquito bite me, that's the same way. Oh, the mosquitoes. Oh, yes. This is the last time this is going to happen to me. Come winter next year, it's not going to yeah. catch me in the UK. Oh, yeah. Just retire. I um I don't I don't want to be in the cold. I don't want to be in the cold weather. You know I don't I'm, you know I don't want to be there. So I look D D is in Jamaica. D love Jamaica. That must be the longest place she stay at from from she's been traveling. Mama, D loves black chocolate. Point of correction. Hey, <laughs> black chocolate is not our bait. D loves black chocolate, not Jamaica. <laughs> I just want to hope and I pray. Eh? If this their ship, if something, if something happens to this their ship, I just pray that D will continue to be Jamaica, Jamaica. She will continue to like Jamaica. She will continue to love Jamaica. I just hope. That she continues to love Jamaica. I love Jamaica too. I love the way D loves Jamaica. I'm actually tapping this love that D got for Jamaica from her. Because uh, Jamaica, Jamaica, Jamaica. Mama said it that D has spent longest time compared to other countries that she has. What do you think? You ask yourself, put one or two together now. <laughs> Baba is also a reactor. You know, she kept saying, Oh, I'm not a YouTuber and I don't intend to do YouTube like she doesn't want to, but she's really, really fun to be with. It's a very long interview, more than one hour. You can go to Peter C7 and catch up because we can bring everything here, of course, because of time. You understand? But she's a very wise woman. I love when she said, I pretended. I pretended. Of course, because you can't just say, Oh, because somebody said, oh, Kuku Mama is a nice person. Oh, Kuku Mama is so sweet. Oh, Kuku Mama told me, no, don't worry, don't worry. I'm going to make everything available for you. Whatever you want, just tell me. It doesn't make me a good person. I might just say that to make you feel good. I might just say that so that I don't cause any havoc. I don't bring any problem or tension. So it's not good sometimes. When you know that you hey, your life out there, when you know that your reputation out there get RCP, you know it's somehow... You also mind the kind of question you ask people. Marwa asked the Jonas wife, Oh, where did you meet your husband? Of course, the Jonas wife met with the Jonas through Marwa's channel. Probably remember when they did collaboration together. They just met, not even quite long. This is their marriage. Eh? <laughs> the way everything is going fast, fast. And I just, I'm, you guys should leave me alone. Let me say it. I'm just praying that the way they are fast. Yeah, that the problem will not come fast like that. Hmm. It's not their portion anyway. Let's watch another version of this their wedding because till now I've not seen Vidi Jonah posting. Will I say that they are still enjoying their honeymoon? You understand what I mean? Marriage is sweet when you marry the right person. Of course. <laughs> Vidi Jonah's wife embarrassed Marwa. Embarrassed him and embarrassed him right in front of Roro Roro. Ro. Hey, I'm like, hey, hey, what are you trying to say now, Mama? Are you trying to become lazy reactor by telling Marwan something like this? The indigenous wife was like, do you want me to tell you the truth or the bitter truth about what I think about you? 
when you were in Yankee? Do you want me? Of course, I'm gonna tell you guys what video Jonas because me overthinking will not finish me. I will tell you what she thought about Marwa. I will help her since she don't want to tell Marwa. She told Marwa, no, I'm gonna talk to you offline because I don't want to cause problem for you. Hey, did they, <laughs> she probably knows that. Of course, she knows that lazy reactors will grab it. Let's watch them. So to now, to now, now I'm gone. Congratulations! Thank you so much, and thanks to um, that um, guy there for <laughs> giving me a husband. They, they. So how how did you two meet? Just like one minute. Wrong <laughs> <laughs> well, no I used to watch you. Yeah. Well, you want the truth or the fake truth? The, no the truth. fake the truth. truth. The truth. The truth. Truth. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> It's, yeah. a, it's a bad one now. Are you ready? Yeah. <laughs> it's yeah. a very bad one. It's no, controversial. Okay, no problem. Go I'll you. offend you, so I won't. No, no, I'll no, give no. you the fake one. The fake one. No, 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 the fake truth. truth. The truth. That's really intriguing. <laughs> so I used to watch you, and I was like so intrigued by you. I used to follow you, especially when you were in America. Yeah. I don't want to say I'll offend you. Okay, no, no, no. just say it. No, yeah. it's very bad. No, just say it. Yeah. Yeah. So, um, uh, no, I won't. <laughs> 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 okay. Many cameras. It's bad. <laughs> no, it's bad. I might offend. No, no it's problem. okay. No, I don't want to give uh, attention where attention is not supposed to be. So okay. I, I won't say. I'll, I'll say it off camera. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Now tell us the good story. Yeah, yeah, it, yeah. it was because of you. Okay. So I, I, yeah, I used to watch you. Um, I, I, I love watching YouTube. Usually I watch um educational things. And one day you just popped up on my feed, and I was like, yeah. oh, this is so interesting. You were in India. Yeah. And I was thinking, wow, th this guy is very interesting. Yeah. So I started to follow you and to yeah. watch you. Yeah. And yeah, one thing led to another. Yeah. And I won't say the other part, but yeah. then I met him. Okay. <laughs> That's right. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. Off camera. Oh, yeah. Off camera. Oh, yeah. <laughs> no, he is coming. I'm here. Oh, bring it. It's a YouTube wedding, guys. Yeah, it's a DIY wedding. Yeah, yeah. Oh, really? Yeah. You look good. It's a local tailor. Today. We made a dress today. I went to the local tailor. I was like a bright sailor. I said, I want it like this. Like that. Like this. They were fed up with me. Uh, yeah, but, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Uh, we think, think the most famous uh, wedding in the village. Yeah. And uh, we have our brother Billy Jones yeah. over there. Yeah. Congratulations, Billy Jones. Yeah. Yeah. Congratulations. Yeah. Uh, can we tell him congratulations once? Congratulations! congratulations. congratulations. Uh, we're going to sit down. Everyone, please, you can sit down. Thank <laughs> 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 One more time. Give us attention, Mama. What do you mean you don't want to give us attention? You should give us attention. Say it, spill the beans. What do you have to say about Marwa? Marwa is controversial. Marwa is stingy. Marwa is extra. Eh? He's always acting up. When he was in Yankee, he didn't want to spend even one cent on anything. Yani? Huh? Tell me who does that. You've come to collect, but you are not ready to even invest. What happened when he was in Yankee? It was too much. He spent money to bring a girl. And someone do what? Hijack the girl. He spent money. He bought tickets for this girl. But at the same time, he's always asking for donation. Guys, donate, donate, donate. Guys, support me. You know, tra this traveling takes a lot of money. Uh, he wasn't even ready to pay for his own Uber. He used people. He used Oga Mitowa through and through. Even when Mitowa came to his home, Marwa did not present anything. Mutua bought his drink. Mutua, <laughs> someone was asking, where is the kitchen makeover that Mrs. Mutua promised Marwa? Marwa is still waiting for it. Up till now, Marwa is still waiting for the kitchen makeover from the Mitowas. <laughs> hey! Gimme, gimme, gimme.com. You must give, but he will not return anything back, even when you work for him. Mr. Kenge, pay Alex his two month salary. He deserves it, he worked for it. 
There's something else that Roro Roro told this lady. Roro was like, so you guys married two days ago. This is just a ceremony. And she was like, yeah, 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 yeah. We married two days ago. Where's the proof? <laughs> In church? Because they dress like it's English wedding. So who is the officiating priest? Who married them? At least they showed us the little one they did in the mosque. This other one, you just call people to... Guys, this movie is not moving. You see this, they can't get wood. Eh? <laughs> it's not making sense. You can't just call YouTubers and you'll be like, Oh, we're having a small ceremony. Let's just eat. She was uncomfortable, uncomfortable. I felt embarrassed on her behalf because these YouTubers, almost like more than 30 people were recording them. These content creators, eh, they will not kill me. All of them placed camera on the Dijon and his woman's face. He got to a point, this woman was like, can you all go and sit down? <laughs> She's so focal like that. She told them to go and sit down. Enough, enough. What is this? Allow me to breathe. Like she was coughing, she was sweating. It was too much on her. I felt her discomfort on her behalf, honestly speaking. Let's move to Joyce Sist, okay? Joyce Sist is another drama drama lady. Came for channel recharging. You can't compare her. She's very, very far away from the kind of person, the personality of Jamaican grandma. No, 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 no. You can't. You can't. She's trying to use this one and climb. Because, of course, when she came to Iyabohanze, she thought that when she left, yeah, she will continue getting these views. You know, Marawa armies, Marawa supporters will continue supporting her. What she bargained for is not what she's getting. So now that this incident of Jamaican grandma came, she went on her IG to drop this. From what I'm seeing, there will be a time when I will be left with no choice but to break my silence and tell my real experience. Hope people can learn from their mistakes and make some changes. Trying to remain loyal, but I'm sick of feeling guilty. One more mysterious situation and I will break my silence. What is the mysterious situation? Mama, when you came to your house, you thought that Coco Mama and other reactors are your problem. You called us names. Just coming. Guys, this woman doesn't have any idea about what was going on. What we are reacting on. She just came in just because she wanted to grow her channel. And she probably thought that after she must have left the Yabuhanze that the view will continue to, you know, drop. She thought that her channel will continue to remain the same. She is frustrated, frustrated. She is the most frustrated woman being I've ever seen. Madam, go and sit down. Break your silence words. Break your nonsense silence. You came there for your own interior motive. Keep quiet. There's another Marawa army reactor aka reactor that was on coco mama's neck there's nothing that this girl did not do to me she even went and grabbed my private things just to make sure that she drags me what is happening today she has turned against the kenge now join this after all she did let's be looking at when she was there what what really happened what did she do let's start looking at let's start Listening to this confused human being. You will never use this to shine, Joyce. Nobody will believe your story because we know you got mental. You have serious mental issues. You came to Marwa's for your own selfish reasons. That was why you came for us. You had the audacity to throw insults at us. But what happened? The table flipped around. When you left, nothing was there. She was actually forced to leave. Because it got to a point. <laughs> Basically, she was living on these guys. She was grabbing their views. She was there in their home. She was even looking like as if she was about to take over from Congress mom. Shameless people everywhere. Let's watch What them. do you love like mostly about our family? You know, this must be very powerful, like you're saying, you know, I'm going to Nyabu Hans. I love your UK. family, yes. Yeah. I love your family. Number one reason is yeah. because yeah. you guys are very hard working. Thank you. Very, very hard working. From the mother, from yeah. the father to yeah. the mother, the yeah. children, from the oldest to the youngest, they yeah. are all hard working. Very hard working. Like, yeah, and they are 
how, how you say resilience? Yeah, resilience. Yes. yes. Oh my God. Yeah. These people. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and I want to tap into that, guys. <laughs> Yeah. Oh guys, please go check her YouTube channel out. Yeah. Uh, we're gonna be working. I think we can walk now. Yeah, yeah. You've rested. Yeah. Or you want to start the yoga classes? Yeah. <laughs> yes. I start to go Marwa. Yes. In UK. Yeah. I am not love, and yeah. I don't care. Yeah. Because people think. Yeah. I'm not. People think I'm a unhappy person. Yeah. Unhappy. Yeah. Unhappy person. Yeah. You understand? People yeah. see me as this person who is just angry all the time. <laughs> but, but since I yeah. came here, you know, you see me yeah. happy. And yeah, yeah, yeah. Because yeah. I'm feeling free. Yeah. I'm feeling, uh, um, at, I'm at peace. At peace. Yes. Yeah. And I'm free. This is my real personality wow. for my country. Wow. People who think I'm crazy. People think I'm unhappy person. People think I have lost it when I'm in the UK. But now that I'm in the Yamahansi, I am happy. Look at me. I want to tap into this blessing. Hey, these guys are hardworking. From mom to dad to the children, everybody's hardworking. I am a happy person now. I'm no longer depressed. Joyce, is which one do we believe now? Huh? Which silence do you want to break again? Which silence do you want to break? Mama, rest. You cannot use this one to trend. It's, uh, 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 uh. it's not going to work. There's nothing this woman will come and say, I will believe her. Listen to her when she just came. She claimed that she doesn't know anything about us. How can you insult someone that you don't know like this? Throwing words, throwing insults, serious allegation. Tell me where this is done. Bipolar is not a joke. You need to go and treat yourself, madam. The embarrassment is too much now. How many months? She left before Christmas. Then more than three months. You want to break your silence. <laughs> the highest thing I would say, guys, is maybe she was infected with malaria. And of course, she's, she got a lot going on already. She never wanted to leave your hands. But of course, you know when you are somewhere and financially you, you, don't, you can't even pay for your own meal. Whoever that you are with, with, this person is not related to you. The person will automatically feel uncomfortable. You, you get it. She's from Liberia. If she wanted to relocate and move to, you know, Africa and live African lifestyle and all that, at least she should have done this in her home country, Liberia. She's Liberian. No, because of Marwa, because she wants, she has already seen it, planned it out. That once I buy my ticket, Probably buy a few things, gift items, which she did. Once I get to your hands, this big YouTuber will help me climb and I will make it on YouTube. And even if I come back to the UK, people will be following me like a goat. <laughs> you think that is how you want? <laughs> people want to see what you have to bring on the table. It's not about Marwa, it's about you. Even if you go back or now that you are trying to use this one to shine, now she wants to use Marwa negatively to shine because positive did not work this is what we are seeing on the streets you see so-called marwa defense force some of them are stylishly now you you are watching you look at their tongue there you'll be like no 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 who what is she saying you even get confused because we know already that Marwa people, the people that support Marwa, <laughs> we know you once you look at their thumbnail, you already know what's going on. <laughs> yeah, they understand there's no surprise anymore. You know that for sure. Of course, from the beginning of that video till the end, Marwa anthem. Marwa praises. Oh, Marwa is good. Oh, this guy is working hard. You guys, you evil women. Oh, why are you doing this? You are feeding out of them. Oh, 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 oh. We know already. Let's continue watching Joyce's mad woman, complete mad. Is this one? Hey, believe whatever she. I know she will come for sure. I'm very very sure. Oh, I'm feeling guilty. You're feeling, feeling which guilty? Who asked you to come to your house? Nonsense, human being. So, yes. I feel like it's very important to normally defend your own people. Was she even looking for me? I think she was trying to... Look for... <laughs> oh, <God. laughs> Look for... Man, she was looking for a man. 
Maybe you're the right person. <laughs> Go for your own age, okay? This hey. <laughs> is here to deal with you Jesus all. Deal with you. This is not hey. just in this time round. No, it's like it's fire after fire. fire. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Hey, like I don't know. They have their own men in their houses. They have their but own. Then now, they are not satisfied. <laughs> and now she's looking for young blood. <laughs> Are you ready to give in? <laughs> Debbie don't want to. Debbie is a baby. Debbie yeah. just a baby. Yeah. Such kind of older people. Uh -huh. You know all the beautiful girls that are pushing yeah. herself on mm -hmm. Debbie? Mm -hmm. He don't want you. You're too old. Joyce is not joking with you all. I think I like <laughs> Joyce is here to Joyce give is? you. Diary, please no, guys subscribe it's to her channel. She's fun. Why yeah. she's a fan? Did she have to call him? Mm -hmm. so you no, already no. against his family. Mm -hmm. Yeah. You think he wants to talk to you? Why mm -hmm. would you want to? Why? Oh, yeah. yeah. Why? If you are a reactor, she's yeah. able just to look at videos and that's it. She's not even reacting. She's just hate. Hey, she's putting out there. You understand? That's not reaction. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Josie is not to deal with you. What? No, no, no. When she's talking all this, like this. <laughs> You know who I'm talking about, right? Yes. I don't want to call her anymore. She's talking her lips close like this. <laughs> Joy! <laughs> and then... Who would believe a confused person like this? You flew in from the UK to come and be talking rubbish things like this. All the way from UK, guys. This is what this woman came to do in the Yabahazi. Reactors became her problem. Oh, you are running after that, you know, you are too old. You are not just old, you are useless. You are so useless. Guys, I've never seen such a confused human being in my life. I'm not joking. This woman is so, so confused. You need to see how there was another one that she did with the and She was like, Oh, I can't believe when I came here, I didn't have even one subscriber. Now I have how many that now I have 3,000 subscribers. Now look at my views, I'm getting 6,000 views. As you are supporting the Virginia, please support me. You can tell that the main reason why this woman is written all over her that she came to grow her YouTube channel. She came to grow her YouTube channel. That's why she can no longer believe it. That after she came to Yobohanse, and that's it. Marowa is no longer calling her. Nobody's checking on her. Nobody cares. Nobody really cares. Why would they even care? Eh? <laughs> you didn't even buy acres of land. Information we are getting is that Mama actually bought 2.5 acres of land. And that same land, the Kenge warned Mayogno not to buy it. But they forced Mama, a foreigner, to buy it. Because they know that, okay, if this foreigner buys it, this land is not a good one. It's not a table land. With erosion and everything, Mama might decide not to even do anything with it. And who will take over the land? Of course, the land is on whose name? On Marwa's name. If Marwa will ignore someone who bought a land on his name, the person even passed on and Marwa was not aware of it. You think that he will give you attention, Joyce? Eh? If you have sent money to him, you can quietly go and ask for your money back. We have got no time for you. You cannot trend with this one. Never! I will never, Wallahi, guys, I will never believe this woman. If she comes up with the, oh, these people are fetish. You see, Michele Ponte, there was someone that dropped the comments and said that Michele Ponte wants all of us, but nobody believed, nobody listened to him. Remember when Michele was in that village? He got malaria, okay? And he said that these guys are into traditional stuff. He didn't open up much, but he said stuff like that. That one we know already. What else are you going to talk about? There's, um, of course, there's what we call voodoo or whatever. Traditional way people can get rid of others. You can be poisoned. There's one we call slow poison. You, there's, one day, there's one again, people believe that even when you are from far, someone can invoke evil spirits that will affect you. All those ones we know already. But me, personally, it's what you believe in that will affect you. If I'm ready to go to your hands, I will go. And the God that protects his children, who protect Coco Mama of the Most High. Nothing will happen to me. I'm not yet ready for that journey. But if I'm ready, 
Wallahi, I'm not scared of the voodoo. Even if Marwa is the chief voodoo of... Let's say that Mr. Kenge is chief priest of these things. These local traditional things that they do. It's not going to affect me. For what? It's what you know that will kill you. What you've got no idea. God will still have a way of setting you free. That's what I believe in. Joy sees. Go and pack one side. Go and rest. You are shameless. You are stupid. You are useless. You said that you are stupid. Don't you look stupid now? As soon as you came to this village, it was praises. Praises upon praises. Oh, they work hard. Oh, these reactors, they are stupid. Look at how they are old women. Oh, they are doing the oh, they are doing the other. Who is looking stupid now? You're turning back to say you want to break your silence. Keep that your silence forever. Keep it in your pocket. We don't need it. I, for one person, personally, I don't need your silence. Don't break it. Don't even bother. Okay, I'm very stupid because it doesn't make sense. <laughs> no, it's true. It's, I like it's you. Thing like that. Uh -huh. It's very stupid for you to think like that. Yeah, it hurts me. Uh -huh. The way these people behave, you know, it hurts me. I, I, didn't, I didn't know these people before coming here. Uh -huh. Prior to coming here, I didn't know them. Uh -huh. But, I mean, why would you talk about people like that? You know what I mean? Uh -huh. it's just It just doesn't make sense. Uh -huh. You wouldn't want other people to treat you like that. Why would you treat exactly. other people like that? Exactly. It doesn't make sense. Yeah, so if you think like that, you are stupid. Allah. <laughs> Can you see? <laughs> How? Like, Yanni, this woman is losing it. This woman has lost it. Lost it. This woman has lost her mind. Even before she came to this village. She came with attack. She came to fight. She thought that, okay, after she must have done this, Marwa supporters will follow her because of the fact that she fights for Marwa or because she insulted us. What is going on? Eh? She now wants to come with her own drama. She wants, I'm very, very sure that whatever story that she's coming up with, she made it up. Whatever story or whatever plan that she has now, 100% is a made up plan. It's a made up story. Mm -hmm. She wants to use negativity to come in now. She said that, she, oh, I don't want to do reaction. I don't want to do this. Other. You can't. You can't do reaction. This is not how reaction is done. You continue to leak acts. You will continue to worship and leak acts. You must continue. Marwa and his family, they are good people. You must leave it like that. They are good people. We don't care whether they have borrowed money from you or whether they have treated you a certain way. Or whether they, they did something to you, they, or whether they threw you out, for sure. I suspected, I even said it, I reacted that time she left, that how can this woman who said that now she's okay, she's no longer having depression, she's no longer feeling bad or feeling like uh, she's losing her mind, that she's very happy now in the village. This is where she wants to stay. How come all of a sudden she's leaving? You know? And I can tell. When she left, she did this video and complaining. Oh, my whole body was spending me. You are from malaria prone country. There's malaria in Liberia, my dear. If you go to Liberia, you will still be infected with malaria. When you treated yourself, you got back to the UK, you treated yourself and you were fine. So keep quiet. Pack one side. Guys, can we move to the Coco Girl before we call it a day? Got no time for useless people like this. Very confused human being. Lord have mercy. Chai! Oh my goodness. Eh? Hey, look at how she wants to come and use our Jamaican grandma to shine. Hey! <laughs> she wants to take over the show. <laughs> she wants to come and... Hey! It will not happen. She shall not be well with you. With the kind of mind you have. It shall not be well with you. Joyce is. You are not a good person. You are not here or there. All rounder, you went to Marwa Army, went to Marwa foot soldiers to rubbish us, to condemn what we are doing, call us names, abuse us, accuse us. Still, you are not satisfied. Now you are coming for your guy, eh? Biting the finger that fed you. <laughs> you know what, guys? I don't feel sorry for Mr. Kenke. He deserves it because when you are greedy, this is what you get. 
when you don't know your worth, when you are not even satisfied. Meanwhile, this guy is making money. But oh, so long as you go, oh, I'm coming because of what he will get from you. I'm not saying that he shouldn't receive visitors. I'm not saying that as a YouTuber, you cannot, you know, connect with your subscribers, the genuine ones. But Mr. Kenge's own is too much, guys. His own is choking us. His own is too much. He's overdoing it. Our girl, Coco Girl, is still very much Jamaica. I love the way these guys are doing their charity now. Like I said yesterday, if you must do charity, start from your own. You know, some Kino's people kind of agreed with me that, yes, Kino needs medical assistance, okay? Whatever he's doing. I love the responses I got. I got to know that actually Kino is doing a lot for the community. He's transparent. He's bringing receipts, which is just the point that I made yesterday. I mean, if you receive a bottle of water, don't say, oh, I received some water. You have to mention the figure, state it clearly, and where it's coming from and how you have spent it that's basically i'm not like uh, trying to kick him under the box or trying to make him look like whatever he's doing he's stealing or no 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 no. it's far from that i'm just saying that he needs more help okay happy that some people got it some they feel like oh i'm trying to bad mouth his work but anyway everybody must not agree with whatever i'm saying here i'm not expecting that now Again, Coco Girl met this guy that was a victim of, I don't know what happened, but he lost his both arms, even the legs, he's bedridden on wheelchair. And Coco Girl actually, throughout the content, I was laughing, Coco Girl assisted him because this guy could not even feed himself. So Coco Girl assisted him, spent some money, bought diapers for him, bought some blankets, bought some few stuff. And this guy was even asking Coco Girl, can you help me? Because there was this guy that helped this guy. You know, he pays this guy that uh, assists him to move around or probably assist him when he's going around asking for help, okay? So he was even asking Coco Girl to buy some stuff for the guy. At some point, Coco Girl refused because we know Coco Girl. Coco Girl is like that. Certain things we are not even supposed to be reminded. You have to take care of this guy. Coco Girl told the guy that, you know what, I'm focusing on you. You first. I don't care about any other person. I'm not connected. I don't feel like I should extend whatever I'm doing for you to the person that looks after you. Okay? So... But looking at it, you know, Coco Girl is this kind of a person. This is her. This is Coco Girl for you. You cannot force her. She might come to a place now and there are so many people there. You will be shocked that she might actually pick someone who may not need that help. That's the way she does her own thing. Well, what can we say? For me, she could have bought something for the guy. Because if you make someone... Who looks after this bedridden guy happy? He will be happy to do that job. And you are indirectly helping that bedridden person. But then, anyway, like I said, she didn't see it that way. She didn't see that, you know, extending this help if she can. Because again, it depends on her pocket and the connection. It's not about giving, it's about the mind, about the spirit. Okay, you might give someone something. And in your mind, it's as if you are not happy doing that. Or you feel like, oh, I shouldn't have done this. Something like this. Let's watch them before we call it a day. Hey, brother. Hey, Ricardo. You okay? I'm all right, myself. I'm saying I'm not prayer. I'm not a gun. I'm not a weed. I'm an eye. Eye? What is eye? You speak? Why am I sure I go down? Go down my place. Don't take a shower. Mm, you, you still want to take a shower? Under the weed. But I want to tell you that for me, you are uh, you clean. You are good. It's okay here. Yeah. Where is the direction you want? This or this? I'm going to that old cell. We get the marina. See the old cell here. This one. Okay. Let's go. Yeah, it's just a lot of money, probably. 
Yeah. That's it, good in the NP. You have money problem? I don't, I don't fucking care. I'm telling you, I want good energy. I'm now with you. I want stress. I want 13 on it. What is the price, my sister? 3,000 on it. Okay, let's buy this. You are here for me. Yes. You are serving me, but yes. I want you to look out for him too. I need him to get like a, a, a pair of sweat side me too. This? Yes. Of course, yes. I, I bring him food now. No, not food. I want you to get a pair of sweat slide me too. Sweater? Yeah, Sweater? Like, like a jack pants and a sweat. I don't know. Let me think about it. I will think about it because I am here for you only. I'm not, I'm not here for other people. Oh my goodness. I love the fact that she took out her time. Even though she will make money from this, but she gave, she paid for the stuff for the guy. The guy actually wanted her to give to the person that looks after him, but Coco Girl refused. This is Coco Girl for you. But the guy also, when he jumped into the car and Coco Girl was already inside the car, trying to be nice, trying to start a conversation with him, and hear him telling Coco Girl, no, no, I don't want to talk. I don't feel comfortable. I want to take a shower. And Coco Girl was trying to make him feel happy. This is the same guy that takes care of this uh, crippled uh, guy. But anyway, for the fact that Coco Girl did not just record him or uh, just be blabbing and telling him no, 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 like she would normally do. We've seen Coco Girl capturing people and still turning them down, telling them that no, 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 my money is for me. My money is for my own food and now she has improved. That's all I can see because then you are telling this person that your money is for you. But you forgot that you are a public person and you make money by people watching you. So if those people are selfish, they will not play your ads. They will not even click on your video. Okay. But of course we keep learning from these things. There's another clip of hers that I want us to look at because again, Coco Girl, you are capturing our children. Even these children were telling Coco Girl, yes, yes, yes. Coco Girl was actually giving them her YouTube account. And two of those kids told Coco Girl that they are going to subscribe. Coco Girl, your content is not for children. Don't do this. I know some children, they do adult stuff on YouTube, but of course, it's not always encouraged because they must start learning certain stuff that they shouldn't know or they shouldn't know at that time something like that so again we need to remind coco girl hey cut our children off this don't bring them even if you record them by mistake don't bring them except if you are handing out something mm -hmm. guys i'm not saying this to kick coco girl i'm just reminding her um nobody's above this kind of mistake okay? We don't want our children on Coco Girl's channel. Mm. Coco Girl is another person that is stuck in Jamaica. I can understand Maya and his wife. Maya is there with his wife. And Maya, <laughs> I like the way Maya is uh, bringing this content, tying these things, you know, making sure that the tie is tying. I mean, African ties with Jamaica is making sense from his own side. Plus, they are showing more of... Um, historical places lifestyle but as coco girl and the of the natus association of kenya their own kind of content is kind of kind of different you guys should make it make sense to us d came to jamaica started putting on a lot of weight i'm looking at coco girl i'm looking at her shoulders it's as if baby girl is gaining but you know she's petite type her own weight gain is not that obvious but if you look at her face you can see that her face is a little bit chubby is it the weather is it the fresh food i know the island is beautiful could food the weather be another reason why they are gaining weight or is there any other thing that we don't know that is happening mm -hmm. is it a male factor yeah hey. is it hot chocolate or whatever can you guys make it make sense to us let's watch coco girl before we call it a day coco mama hey your own is too much but for sure i can tell that the weather over there is conducive i can feel the breeze when i watch some of the vlogs over there power of social media guys one good thing that i love so much is the fact that i've never been to the caribbean but i'm learning a lot i can see i can see the similarities i can see the connection i can feel it just watching the kudos to all the content creators that made it to the caribbeans and they're showing us these beautiful places 
sorry name the Trini Baptist. Hey, Trini Baptist. I can't wait to come to Trini. Guys, eh, if I enter Caribbean, wallahi, I will be moving everywhere and everywhere. I will make sure I touch all these islands. You get what I mean? Hey, hey, hey. I can't even wait. <laughs> of course, it's already there in my bucket list. I've already added it. Let's watch Coco Girl before we call it a day. If I'm hungry in Europe, I can't ask someone say, hey, beg you some food. Mm -hmm. People don't even, they, they just look past mm -hmm. you. Yes. But in true. Jamaica, if I'm hungry, I can go to my neighbor and say, yo. Exactly. Make us some dinner. And now you're a food. Yeah, this is my food and I have responsibility exactly. on myself exactly. only. So, yes. mm. Food is nice. I recommend you to come here. Hey. Mm -hmm. Hi. Hi. Are you vlogging right now? Yeah, I'm vlogging. Oh. For my Press YouTube channel. Oh, you have a YouTube channel? Yes. Oh. Okay. Now you are going to see yourself on my YouTube channel. <laughs> yes. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. Nice to meet you. Bye, be safe. Bye. Thanks. Yes, they're so sweet. That's the Yeah. Coco Space Gear. Okay. I'm gonna subscribe now. Of course, welcome. Okay, welcome okay to I'm gonna James. subscribe later. Okay. I don't know how You see again guys, I'm learning something here. This is similar to where I come from. Where I come from, you can easily go to your neighbor and knock. Please can I have some salt can i have some chili pepper oh can you give me one cup of gary oh like this you can you can easily ask for help without feeling anything hey in the western world i don't think it's possible sometimes you would even like you would even get that face for example before you ask someone for help you must have looked at the person's face and the person is giving you like a welcoming face to ask for whatever what i'm seeing in all these places including where i have been you know sometimes you are trying to start a conversation just to be nice just to say hello like me because of my upbringing i'm kind of used to talking to strangers talking to people random people sometimes you're talking to someone you can tell that this person knows that you are talking to him or her the person will just be moving it's strange coco girl is stuck in jamaica all her vlogs, she's busy with different black chocolate everywhere. Black chocolate is not our mate. D can testify to that. <laughs> At least our D now. We are no longer seeing her trying to, you know, be around Muzungu men. Whatever our sugar daddy Kido did, mm, is working perfectly well for our girl. Mm. Because why I'm saying this is our girl is still very, very, very obsessed with jamaica you can't tell her nothing like you can't tell her anything about Jamaica. she feels so happy with the country she feels fulfilled i will not be surprised if they will move permanently to jamaica <laughs> coco girl don't involve our children in your shenanigan if you must campaign for your youtube growth eh not with our children please i beg you i beg you and when you record them Make sure that you include them. Mm -hmm. Whatever you want, whatever you wish yourself is what they wish themselves as well. Whatever that is good for you is good for them. What is good for Goose is good for the Ganders. All right, guys, if you watch till this moment, you know who you are. You are the best. Thank you all for coming in today to join Coco Mama like you always do. Thank you for your likes. Can I allow you to like this video? Shower me. Shower me with your likes. It's very, very important to me. As you're liking, click on that button. Yes, we have a target. Yeah, we're heading to somewhere. Slowly but surely, we will get there. Yes, yeah, subscribe to the channel if you haven't. Bring someone to the table. Yes, tell a friend to tell a friend about Coco Mama. Hey, I love and appreciate you all from the bottom, bottom mess of my heart. I'll see you all in my another water water. Peace out, peace out, peace out. Bye bye. Bye guys. Slow and put it on me. No, you're like that, she my brother. We gon' live forever. On the island, to the mainland. Pulling up, pinna, pinna.